Oh, that's what we know him, huh? Celebrity apprentice, reality star, businessman. Now he is the Republican presidential front runner. What's he like to work with? What's he like to be behind the scenes? And uh, are you with him as far as being a president? We have two folks who are on that show. Tito Ortiz competed on Celebrity Apprentice, mixed martial arts fighter, UFC champ. He's on the left. Aaron Elmore uh, appeared on The Pre Apprentice. So, Tito, Trump for president. You in or out? I'm in. You're in? I'm actually uh, in just because a person who's going to bring jobs to our country, a person who works hard and support our troops. I'm a huge support tro uh, troop supporter, so I'm there for him 100%. All right, you, Aaron, same. Look, I'm totally in. He was great to me as a contestant on The Apprentice and afterwards helped to advance my career. But I also think just that the American people are so tired of Washington insiders and politics as usual. Oh. They want to change, and the change seems to be Donald Trump. Wow, you were ready for that one. He, he seemed <laughs> to be pleased with that answer. Okay, let me ask you. I'll stay with you, Aaron. I'd like you both to weigh in on this. When this first started, Trump for president, and it's, did you think, okay, flash in the pan, it's not going anywhere, or did you think all along he's got a shot? You know, he always alluded to the fact that he wanted to be president, so I wasn't surprised when he actually ran. At first, people were really naysayers. They weren't feeling it. No. But as the momentum started to build, you could see that this wasn't going to stop. So, and now I think the I traditional like Washington happen. establishment and the Republican Party, they're shaking in their boots because they see people want an outsider. They don't want someone from the inside. And this is really working for Donald Trump. And you know what? Good for him. He came in at the right time in the right place, and he might just as well be our next president Tito as this has played out and he has taken it's unconventional let's just say that uh, have you what's been your reaction have you ever laughed at some of the things he said and thinking yeah that's the way he treated me on the show Tito what about you there's those that say Donald Trump's demeaning to women you say what to them <laughs> Donald Trump was never demeaning to me. He treated me with such decorum and respect. Look at his daughter. She's part of the Trump Organization. Such a class act, but also treated with such respect. He has so many women in high-ranking positions and has for 30, 40 years. So to say that he isn't good to women or any other minority group, I've never seen that. He was nothing but a gentleman and a class act to me. All right. Tito, Aaron, thanks so much. Both in on Donald Trump for president as that train is rolling at this point. Guys, thanks again. Appreciate it. All right, let's talk about American...